by St. Vincent. Got a gown question for you. Has this happened to you recently? You call your elderly parents or grandparents looking to spread Christmas cheer and suddenly find them in a funk. It can happen and no matter what you do, it's hard to get them out of it. We may have the solution at Markham and University. On the seventh floor of CHI St. Vincent Hospital, you'll find the Senior Behavioral Health Unit. Stephen Simmons is the Community Education Coordinator. Usually, um, you know, the holidays are associated with, with traditions that we, that we use and every year and traditions that have been passed down. So if those things uh, seem to change, then that's certainly a sign of something going on. And the changes this year can produce an onset of holiday depression in seniors. And here's what you look for. Extreme fatigue, feelings or thoughts of becoming isolated, uh, behaviors like a, a loss of interest in something that a person would ordinarily take pleasure in doing. So what do you do? Well, first thing, you fight the misconceptions about depression in senior citizens. You know, the, maybe they'll snap out of it, um, you know, or this will pass in time. And you fight the stigma of admitting your elderly relative to a behavioral health unit. It's a difficult decision to make because there is a stigma that's associated with what we do, and that is uh, we're the crazy house. After a screening and questions about a patient's history, individualized programs then help ensure that inpatients make progress after 10 to 12 days. And it is certainly worth the fight because for an elderly patient, their biggest commodity is cut down by depression, and that biggest commodity is time. You can always watch and share our Wear the Gown stories on teachv11.com.